Salate, this is Jeff. This is David. We are playing Darksiders. Yay. There's a little war. Today, where is the, it's a little war. It's a little war. It's like the Franco Prussian War. It's a tiny war. A little tiny war. A little tiny war. I mean, it was it was a major war. It was just the combatants were very small. Yep. Because like, the Franks and the like and army the men, like the modern army men, the toys. Yeah, that's They're actually those are those are life size replicas mm -hmm. of yep. Franco Prussian. Prussians. Prus Prussian? Of, of Prussia. Of Prus Prussia. 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 Pru Khrushchev. Yeah, Khrushchev. Yeah. Khrushchev. 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 Nikita Navratilova. I think I think I should um, get out of some of the programs. The video, I, I, is, not, the video is not running no, very well. No, and I think it's just seeing he's still just one frame of the horse running. That's good. Yeah, we'll we'll we'll, we'll keep that um, brilliant intro. Um, but I'll probably get out of, yeah. <laughs> let's say, you know, Adobe Premiere CS5. Yeah. <laughs> you had that running? Also, this <laughs> music program. Also, 10 tabs in... Everything. Wow. You know, about 14 tabs in Chrome. A few tabs <laughs> in Firefox. Wow. So it turns out when you do all that, it's, you know, BLC it still runs get a little right. slow. It, it runs it okay. It a little slow, yeah. Precisely. Hey Google Chrome, what you doing? I, what you doing? Is it is it even closing? It's not responding. Oh closing no! Closing was too much for it. You're uh. This is why I always you could just, just task manager in process on everything. That's that's why it's easier to just hard reset the computer most times <laughs> than it is to say shut down. Yeah, because that takes like, like, what is it doing? I want to go to sleep now. <laughs> <laughs> I'm just kidding. I don't uh, turn my computer off. It no, just stays you, on. you really don't. I, 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 will, I will be using Task Manager to get rid of CS5. Here. It doesn't <laughs> don't you have to do that, though? Yeah, I kind of do. It's <laughs> for some reason. Just... Sawate, this is Jeff. This is David. We are playing Darksiders. Yep. There's a little war. Tiny. I'm not. We're not. We're not doing that. Joke. Not doing that nope. stupid bit again. No. Uh, we're going to Leviathan's Drift first here in this cavalcade of achievement hunting, treasure, well, treasure hunting, achievement gaining, uh, soul farming, and experience grinding. Yes. It'll be a lot to cover here. Yep. A lot of good tags. For we're gonna the start video. right here in Leviathan's Drift. Now, in Leviathan's Drift, if you press right on the analog stick. Yeah. You will run in a circle with uh, your horse. Okay. Uh, okay. There is an achievement for running 500 miles with your horse. It's called Dark Rider. It's called Dark Rider. Yeah, it's called Dark Rider. Dark Rider. Okay. okay. Um, so you just kind of set something on the control stick, <laughs> so that it goes, and right. then come back later. Yeah. So we're checking the miles at 162 now. Uh, I did want to check because it doesn't tell you how much you've traveled. It has to be on horse. Oh. It doesn't really tell you. So I just kind of guessed. I went for about 60 miles here. Uh, as okay, the rest of this video will be not in order exactly. Okay. Because I got bored with some crap and uh. <laughs> so, for instance, now we're we'll come back to the horse riding. Okay. So the very next one we're gonna do. Uh, there's an achievement for killing dudes on, on yeah on your horse. On your horse. Okay. So we go to the Ashlands, our okay. favorite favorite place, best place. So much. So brown. So much to do in the Ashlands. So much to break. Uh, but this is the best place uh, for, and in fact, for soul farming, which will be later in the video. Yeah. Uh, but also for uh, grinding out kills. <laughs> you were going horse. the wrong I, way. No, I wasn't. I was intentionally going that way to show that it's not the right way. Okay. Because we've never right. been to the Ashlands before. We've never been, ever. 27 parts. Yeah. 15 hours. How much of a, a damage boost does your uh, Apaka Blade give you? The Apaka Blade? Armageddon, whatever. It's, I don't know. Quite a bit. Um, it's enough to uh, one-shot small enemies. Oh, that's nice. Uh, which will be good, because this is in the northwest, sorry, northeastern corridor. So look at that. Yeah. Slice, slice, slice. That's slice, slice. ridiculous. That was, uh, that's, it's, if you have the level 4 Armageddon Blade, what, there's only one kind of what I'm trying to say is get the Armageddon Blade first. That's okay. It's a little bit easier. That makes doing uh, this, this particular corridor TV. here. Uh, like I mentioned, this is the northeastern part. This is leading to where we fought the um, 
not the Stygian, uh, but the, the Sandworm. Right, right, right. Like the, the smaller Stygi. The Stygiite. Stygite. Stygite. The, um, st st little Stygi. St Stygi. Yeah. Skeeter. Oh. Yeah, Skeeter. Yeah. This is where we killed Skeeter. Got this it. This is where, yeah, this is where the Skeeter murder ha happened. Still under investigation. Can't really talk too much about that. Right. Uh, going up to this alcove over here. We get an auto save. Auto save. Auto save. It's like a rocket launch. Okay, so when we load our auto save, the enemies will reappear in a quarter, and we'll go down the quarter, and we'll kill them again. How many enemies per shot? You think? It's about twelve. There's just twelve little guys in that corridor, and the the achievement I think is it's either one hundred or one fifty. Oh, so that's uh, less horse. than ten. If yeah, it's hundred. And, and also, um, uh, shooting kills count if you're on horseback. It's it's kills on horseback. So you, you just have use... to actually be on horse. Yeah. That's it. Okay. Precisely. Uh, but this is just too fun. Just. <laughs> it's because it's because they're little soldiers. Yes. yes. They're small. It's, it's a little Tiny. war. I killed like four of them <laughs> with one strike. It sure did. This is really reminding me of Dynasty Warriors, right? Now. <laughs> yeah, it has a um. Just when you're there when you're is full a power. quality. <laughs> to the yeah. proceedings here. It's like, oh, oh, you're in my way, and now you're not. And I just apparently killed 57 people with one hit. Yeah, it happens. Oh. A little snip there, uh, going back around for another pass. Makes the cut, cut a lot from this, because grinding is, well, it's, it's, gr it's, it's grindy. It, it's, it's fun to do, but it's not fun to watch. Yeah. Is that because I was just, um, like, for the, which one was the one? The experience grinding we'll do a little bit later for weapon yeah weapon levels i was just doing that mindlessly while listening to podcasts and stuff <laughs> and like music yeah got the um that's what you do yeah i did get the um uh the orphan land cd as okay. well as that mira cd yeah. those are cool those are really good yeah i've been uh recommended you know if you're into is <laughs> israeli folk progressive death metal and I, I happen to be because so. that's some weird time signatures with some great scales. Yeah, good scales. But uh, yeah, when I was whenever I was doing all that Persona Three grinding, mm -hmm. that was a whole bunch of just comedy routines. Just uh, any particular uh, go tos, or you're just browsing. Uh, I just did a search for uh, Comedy Central presents, and then I and then found, just started watching them. Yeah, I started watching them, and I just broke it down from there. But. Uh, like there we yeah. go, horseman. Yeah. I'm officially a horseman. Yay! 150. 150. That is the one. Okay. Yeah. So fair enough. But but no, it was uh, Ralphie May is really fun in some instances, but really kind of not funny at all in a lot of others. So he tried. He was the one that was uh, one last comic standing that first. Uh, time. I don't know if the he sort will, of no. The I think the first fat, one that guy. That's I think sort of his thing. No, the first one who won was Dat Fan, I think. And you're oh, burning okay. him to death. Yes, because that 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 enemy had the audacity to hit me. Meanwhile, <laughs> still still running, still, still going, still, still riding, still riding. Oh, oh. All right, now we're back. We'll still be, we'll, we'll be checking we'll in be on checking we'll in. be right, checking right. in on war in the uh, Leviathan's drift there periodically just to just to see what's going on. Yeah. Uh, our next goal is, in fact, to level up our weapons. Okay, and that's we've... that's in uh, the Iron Canopy? Yes, yes, in fact. We'll be going to the Iron Canopy. Uh, we'll spot... I just have to kill these guys. Well, you have to. It's it's the way it works. And now you have the Armageddon Blade, so it's kind of trivial. Yeah, it's, it's more trivial. It's not super trivial. Well, I mean... Wow. We don't, <laughs> I don't have all the colored pieces yet. I can't go to the middle of the board. Right. It's not super trivial. Iron Canopy. Iron Canopy. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. That's... We're heading. Uh, hey, look. How am I going to get up there? Uh, all right. Shortcut. Whee! And using death as a shortcut. That's what you kind of have that's to do That's war's sometimes. way. I wonder how death does that. Just use himself as a shortcut. Y yeah. That... Yes. Yeah, yeah. yeah. That, 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 makes that makes sense. It follows. Yeah. Sequitur. Yep. That means 
follow. It, 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 it follows. follows. Because non non sequitur means it it, it, it does follow. follow. Yes. It's it's it's, uh, it's, it's Latin. Yes. Yeah. It, it is Latin. It is it is true. Yes. It, it's uh, it's something you're familiar with. Uh, I I am vaguely familiar with Latin. Yes. Uh, I've I've had to sing a lot of Latin, but I don't necessarily speak at all. That's true. It's like, now did you did you do the uh, the pronunciations? How did you, how did you present it? Uh, we of did bees? we it, of of what? Like these. Uh, it depended on the song. Um, because like, we did like a soft v sound or a w sound. Uh, w. we did we did both. Yeah. Okay. Because it really it, it depended on the um on the the bass language. We were doing Germanic Latin, uh, Roman Latin, Italian Latin, one of them. Which they're apparently all different things. Did you know? <laughs> I was vaguely aware that Germanic and Romanic languages were... Well, it strikes me as weird that Germanic Latin is a thing because I was always assumed that it's, the biggest it's basically you know, sort of the, categories of language are you know, Germanic languages, well, like it's, English, bizarrely enough, and then like Romance languages. Well, sort of. it's like you've got um, uh, Carmina Burana. Yeah. Uh, that was written by a bunch of monks, and they were Germanic monks. But it's all in Latin, so they're speaking a foreign language with a German accent, pretty much. Oh, okay. So it works out. So, uh, the, like for example, the, the word quinquis, or or however you want to say it, uh -huh. uh, we would have to sing quinquis, uh -huh. which is really fun when you're having to go quinquis, and it has to sound like the right words, even though the people in the audience they can't tell the difference. But you're singing about drinking a lot, so you kind of have to get the numbers and everything right. Oh, terms. Yep. Was well, it? I love how he opens yeah, those gotta doors. Open that door. uh, a little sniff there because I, I turned the wrong direction. This is the grinding spot. Right. That little autosave there is how we're gonna respawn this enemy room full of spiders here. Right. Um, we're gonna start by finishing uh, leveling up our uh, trimmer gauntlet because right. it is by far the easiest. easiest to do. I mean, maybe it, it, it has to do with that area of effect thing. It does. Yes, indeed. The uh, the level 2 sort of smash attack um, is capable of killing them all. Uh, that actually was a... Oh, that's a that was a Blade Geyser. Ah. So. Uh. An achievement for killing 10 enemies with the Blade Geyser. Well, there we go. Look, look at our happy warriors. <laughs> Is there an achievement for killing ten enemies at once with any other thing? No. Just the Blade Geyser. And why are you switching that out for experience? Uh, yes. Okay. Uh, War's Glory gives you the most um, boost in damage plus uh, weapon experience. So naturally you just want to equip that on whatever you're trying to level up. Uh, all you have to do is touch the ground at the end of that little ramp and then come back. All the enemies will be back. Oh, that's fine. Uh, I find the easiest way to get them all around you is to shoot the two in the back. Because that'll sort of wake up them there. All? Wake them up. Yes. Uh, say we have a level here we just gained. Yay. Um, it obviously you, takes more and more experience. Experience and, per, yeah. yeah. Is it is it like Persona level ridiculous more experience? No. Or is it, or is it? It's um, for the Trimmer Gauntlet, see, now we're right at level three. Later. We, we'll re repeat that process a number of times. Yeah. The Trimmer Gauntlet does not take very long because these they die fast, and I think because you kill them all at once, you get bonus experience because it's sort of like a higher combo count. There so we, there go. we go. Uh -huh. Now our Trimmer Gauntlet is uh, maxed. He's yeah. maxed out. Delivers maximum damage. Maximum damage. I'm going to punch this guy, and then he doesn't die. And then I punch him again, and he still doesn't die. What? And then I finally kill him with this punch. Or well, play, what, yeah. Well, what, you know, you gotta play. With I was just sad that he didn't die. <laughs> very so you're playing with them. Disconcerting. That's <sighs> all. Yay! Yeah. Or celebrating. Now we have to go and do the scythe, which is horrible. It's so boring. It takes so much experience to level up the scythe. I don't know if it's because it just sucks so much, or yeah. if it actually takes more to level up. And I'm and I'm assuming that's your primary weapon in the next game. So yay! Yeah, but hopefully you'll have more of an opportunity to use more it, combos. Use it proper. Yeah, there's this. There is a dearth, I say, a an dearth, absolute a dearth, dearth of combos of combos for the scythe in this game. Uh, the best one to use here is just the regular ground attack. Yeah. Uh, I was I was trying out the different ones. There's the there's the standing attack with yeah. the the area of effect that spins up, but that just ends up knocking everybody back. And it doesn't kill them. It doesn't, yeah, it doesn't kill them right. You want to keep them all in kind of the same space. So. There we, there we go. go. We have a scythe level there. That's not the final one, but that's how that works out. 
Let's just, we'll just cut this down to the parts that are actually exciting. Yay! Like, hey, I leveled up! Yay! And then bloop! Now nah, I'm at Volgrim because I got bored. So we're going to go buy things. <laughs> so what you got, Volgrim? Let's go uh, buy some stuff. We actually need these for any reason. Uh, well, the, the Wrath Core, the Wrath Shard will need. But, yeah. Uh, like the the empty vessel, we won't need. We will actually need the uh, the rest of the moves. Yeah. Uh, or level up. Oh, yeah. that would probably make leveling it up go a little faster. Yeah, you think so, but not, not really. really. Not no. really. Getting from level three to four on the side took about a straight hour. Wow. Uh, actually, I would say probably about 40, 40 or 45 minutes. Okay. Yeah. Just doing the grinding that room. Grinding in that room. Yes. Uh, this uh, this will be not the last time we see Volgrim, but the last time we'll buy moves from him. Uh, we now officially have all of the uh, all the moves. They're all leveled up. Uh, six grand left over, so I'm gonna go ahead and get uh, just yeah, you know, uh, wrath shard. Rat, baby, yeah, I, yeah, I get yeah, okay. a wrath yeah. shard. Okay, you got a wrath. Yeah, one 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 wrath shard. So I'm, I'm assuming there's just yeah, there's a wrath core, which I don't have enough for just yet. Yeah. And I'll pick up the weapon now. Yeah, mine is fine. You don't actually get an achievement uh, for getting all of the slotted bonuses, but there's a hole in the inventory screen that has to be filled. Yeah, you can, that's not cool. So let's go yeah, and see cool. this. Yeah, there we go. Those two menus, they're gone. No more moves. Oh. I have all the moves. Yeah, dance. Yeah, yep. Yeah, dance. Yeah. Dance for. Meanwhile, back in the Leviathan's Drift. Okay, back at the Iron Canopy. We'll be continuing our Scythe... Scythe-mageddon. Scythe-mageddon. Scythe-pocalypse. Apocalypse? scythe narok scythe narok scythe narok I like scythe narok So there we go. scythe narok continues. The other in-time scenarios. Yeah, I was, I'm, I'm trying to remember. I mean, there's the, the, the Epic of Gilgamesh. That's not really in time. I'm trying to think of the other... Um... Scythe... What's the, uh... The, the scythe meteor kills everything. Scythe meteor. That's yeah. not as... Yeah, that's, that's very Japanese, but that's yeah, not very... That's, uh, that's not as good. Um, what, what, what's the, uh, the Muslim end times called? Uh, I don't know. Huh. I have, I don't know. I don't know. Oh, uh, okay. Well... Look that up. We'll look that up then, yeah. Yeah! Yay! Yes! Finally got my stupid... Okay, battle harden. Uh, it's for maxing out the weapons and also getting the combat moves. Okay. That's not for maxing out the wrath powers. We won't be doing. There's not an achievement for it, and it is ridiculous the amount of uh, souls Soul. required to yeah. get them all up. It will require about, after we're done buying all the stuff from Volgrim that we do need, uh, it will take an additional, I think it calculated it at about like 90,000. Uh, to give you a perspective, uh, we're going to take a little trip to the Drown Pass to go use our scythe on an old friend for one last time. Aww. One last time. We're going to eat in this level's toilet. Well, yep. Yep, in the toilet. Uh, so it goes. So, so it you're going to kill him just with the scythe? Or? Yeah, I'm going to fight him with the scythe because, I don't know, why not? All right, just, just hmm. fight him with but anything you can't else. use your horse? No. I guess not here. Could you like with I the? I don't think you're supposed to ever be able to use your horse. But. Yeah, with the with the Apaka blade, make it um, like trivial. I don't know. The I think it's about the same with the level four. Or I guess I guess this is not technically in order. So the level four side. This is actually not a level four side, but he still dies pretty fast. Yeah, this would be like a level five side, I guess. No, no, I'm saying it was, it was before I had actually. Oh, okay. That's what I meant by out of order. So, oh, I understand I'm trying now. To dynamic editing here to try and you know keep Maybe. it interesting instead of just looking at me fighting enemies nonstop or running around the fight lines. Yay! Okay. All right, now we're back in the Ashlands, and hey, look what happened to the Ashlands! Another bizarre glitch. Wait, that happened while I was so this. What? This is this. Uh, they used to call this um, the good old tutti frutti textures. Um, basically, it happens when, uh, well, okay, so there's, there's textures, the level of detail for the textures, and the way the engine, I guess, works is there's a certain kinds, yeah, distances. Yeah. And it just, when it load, it did not load in one of them, 
<laughs> like the the sand texture. Like I think it was because I got here too fast by going yeah. through some place. Anyways, so it didn't load properly and it just became sort of uh, garbage colors. Great. We'll see. The, the sand will be constant through this entire thing. It'll just have a nice little. Uh, uh, you'll, you'll occasionally just spot little bits of bizarre color. Great. So, so right now, are you doing that spawn in the enemies? Yes. This is the. Times? We are finally in the part where we're going to do some proper soul farming. This is how to get. This really is the fastest way to get. Um, well, soul currency in the right. game. Um, there's. The first time you're here, there's two armored and two unarmored riders. Right. So four total. Uh, a group. Uh, the two of them, armored and unarmored. I think one gives you 140. One gives you 160. Mm -hmm. um, and I did try it with Death's Blessing and without, which supposedly gives you more souls. Yeah. And it, there was no difference. So. Okay. So you just spawn so you in get a ton about of them. two. Yeah. You get each time you go down into the water and come back up, um, two more will spawn. Okay. Um, and you can do that safely. I, it really depends on how your Xbox is feeling. Okay. In this at, case, at I, I don't know how it works on the computer. If it's ju if it is just a RAM issue, which I think, then it, potentially you could have much more on the computer. I don't know how it is on the PS3, but right. certainly on the Xbox, uh, you can go about. I think I got up to about ten or twelve. Okay. Uh, we'll we'll be seeing the exact limit. Okay. After the uh, after we do some grinding here, we we will get all the all this experience that we need, buy the stuff we need from Volgrom, and then we'll go and break the game, <laughs> cause it to cause it freeze, uh, overload the RAM, yeah. freeze everything. You can't. Yeah. But but that's that's later. Okay, so these guys, they have a few attacks that you have to watch out for, like the bomb. Every time you hit them, like right there. Yeah. Every time you hit them, they'll sort of rear up and then charge at you, and that doesn't—it doesn't knock you off your horse. The one that knocks you off your horse is uh, that attack there, the, the, the big plume of yeah. weird blue energy, and that's the worst. It's just the worst. It's, you oh. just get hit by it and just. Oh. 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 Exactly. That's exactly that's, what that's, happens. That's, that, that, so yeah, we, we skip ahead textures. here. Yeah, just you go back. You spawn them, you come back. All right, so now I have basically <laughs> eleven thousand more. Than that I makes this, that makes the fight just yeah. stupid. <laughs> Although it is kind of fun to get a big group of like ten of them in here, like and then just run around in circles and then like just keep tapping, just, just tap that, tap 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 tap, just run in circles, <laughs> hitting that attack button, and you kill them all. Well, they're not all dead yet. They're almost, almost. I, I think this. Yeah, oh, oh, it's the worst. Why? Oh. It's, 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 it's all the momentum is gone. It's it's a horrible feeling. You're just sitting there and sitting there in the sand, looking at the, the fruity textures, <laughs> just uh. contemplating your place in the universe. And there we go. Yes, they are finally dead. They are proper dead. Proper dead. Uh, we only needed seventeen thousand to get the rest of what I wanted from uh, Volgrim. Okay. Uh, all you really needed was the the ten k for the. Uh, the wrath core, mm -hmm. um, but I'm also gonna get the the, the empty vessels, so I have all the bottles, right. I suppose, and then also the other little slotted bonus. Thing. Right. Uh, the other you, things you don't need it, but you need it. Yeah, exactly. The other things you can get from Volgrim are just the upgrades to spells. Yeah, your spells. They go up to level four, um, and I guess to give you a little, like I said earlier, it takes about ninety thousand to get them all leveled up. Mm -hmm. uh, at this point. I've earned in total for the entire game about sixty thousand souls, which wow. is that's not very appealing. No. Now I got the wrath core, and I'm thinking to myself, I don't have all of the wrath pieces yet. No. I'm missing something. Yes. So let's go on a magical journey. Magical. <laughs> Let's go. Let's in fact use the serpent road to go. To, and I mentioned this earlier in a yeah. previous video, but then forgot to actually get it. Even yeah. Though I talked about it. Yeah. So uh, we'll actually be taking the serpent road to the dry road. That's the exit point we need. Right. I uh, was looking around here, just contemplating yeah. why I don't have that. He's he's happy, but he's missing something. Yeah. So let's go to the dry road. Here we go. Okay. This yeah. is the dry road, dry serpent road, road. Yeah, yeah. and then turn around. Turn around. Turn around. Or. But. There it is, yay! Really? Yeah, yeah. And I even, I even mentioned this. I just, I didn't get it. I don't know why I didn't get it. 
So I was like, make sure wow. to go to the serpent roads, and then like here's the three that have items, and then get them. But there is our Woo! wrath of war. We have fully completed our, well, our wraths. Right. So yay! Now we can cast affliction, affliction like, like ten, ten times, times or something stupid like that. It's, uh. I think it's maybe six. Look how happy he is. Yeah, yeah, yeah. What are you get? What? Or you need to stop that. You, we, we have other things to do. We have other things to collect. Stop making the camera do that. Stop floating on. War is not. War. Uh, no, but, don't no, do no. it. Uh. Then we appeared back in the Ashlands. Because, yeah. War feeling particularly, I guess, world destroying. Because I guess destroying all of humanity was enough. No. Wants to destroy all of the post humanity by going up and down this particular vine demonic growth shaft. Right. Approximately ten to twelve times. <laughs> still have the still have the, the texture there. Yeah, the still have the texture, texture glitch problem, but... still there. So what does it take to to reset that? Um I think you, you just have to I guess zone out and zone back in. That's okay. probably all you need to do. Uh, just give it a chance to reload everything. Again, <laughs> and it goes. Oh right, those those textures. Yeah, That's right. It's like I, it's like I have the sand texture. It's right here. No, there's another sand texture. There's another. Oh, oh right. right. There, there, there's another sand texture. I'm, right. re I'm remembering now. There was more than one sand there texture. Was more than one. Yeah. yeah. Too bad they never did that with the building back at the beginning. No. You know, it's... There's not even a texture. I'm sure the the processors just. Yeah. There's something that there's, goes here. There's something just... that goes there. The, the more I think about that, I think maybe it was just that they, there wasn't supposed to be a texture there because it was like a, like an incomplete billboard that, it. But either way, I think the lights needed to be moved back. Yeah, either so moved that back they were or connected just deleted. to something. Yeah. They need to be connected to something. You can even leave the hitbox there. Ridiculous. Just... Ridiculous. 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 Now we're seeing a little, a little flicker here. <laughs> little, little flicker. Just a little, little flicker. Uh, War is starting to kind of phase out of reality. As you know, he is wont to do on occasion. Still looking at all this. There's a lot of dudes back there. There are a lot of dudes back there. They're just kind of <laughs> gathering around. War is not, it's, it's not looking good for War. He's like, of, of all the time I've spent falling into nothingness in the last few videos. Now he's just, he's just gonna go, he's yeah. gonna go for it and just end everything. Right. And this but but until then, <laughs> yeah, 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 thought maybe I just, uh, no. Oh, you thought that was gonna ruin everything? Use the Tremor Gauntlet to destroy was, the world. That, was, that would be perfect. Just, you know, just Tremor Gauntlet and then freezes. <laughs> 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 well, we've already we've technically we've already destroyed the world. Tremor Gauntlet. Yep, that was yep, yep, yep. previous, so we need not do that again. <laughs> wow, that's it's still going, still going. It's chugging. It is. It frame is, rate is, is how, dropping. How how badly was your Xbox crying at this point? I don't know. It was. <laughs> I mean, there was a little tiny white flag that came out of the disc tray, which was kind of weird. Um, yeah. But I guess a nice feature. I, I, I mean, you, you gotta have some way to give warning that's yeah, not that's a red true. ring. Yeah, yeah. Gotta have something. But it's, it's better than the wheeze warning, which is it's just wheezing, gasping breath. Yes. <laughs> Room loaded. We're fine. Oh, <laughs> it's gone. And it's frozen forever. Yep, yep. This is actually the, the video is still recording right now, even though it's it's frozen. <laughs> oh. yeah, have to do a have to do a hard reset on that one. Oh, uh, yes, it was a little three sixty logo. So uh, we're getting a little meta here. <laughs> <laughs> so that that is probably uh, that's probably the the worst glitch uh, in the game. Meanwhile, yeah. Still going. Wait, wait. Yeah. yeah. Got the Dark Rider. Got it. Got the Dark Rider. Successfully traveled 500, 200, 100, 100 miles. It seems like 500 miles. Great it song. It seems like so much. Five, five, that's a great song by the Proclaimers. It really is. I, 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 I have good times. There we go. 100 miles. Wow. Next time on Darksiders, we will beat the game. Yay.
Well, actually, we'll. <laughs> Hanging out in the sand. <laughs> Next time on Darksiders, Phil. We will finish the game. We have all the achievements that we can get before just actually fighting the last boss. Uh, actually completing the game will get us 310 points for <laughs> <laughs> for doing There's it an on achievement and... for beating the last boss. There's an achievement for beating on easy, normal, and hard mode. Which you get all at once. Yeah, and then there's an achievement for getting all of the other achievements as well. What? <laughs> it's It's called BFA. You can... It's just called BFA. You can uh, interpret that how you will. Next time. Dark Siders. <laughs>